I can't wait to be a fuck potato. In a wonderful world of hacking, slashing, and fing. Ow. I mean, nah, I don't know. I don't just buy this. What happens if I get. Oh. What the fk am I doing? Hey guys, I've been enjoying this game from Xbox Game Pass where you get to slash, shoot, punch, and run away from aliens as they try to cook you like I cook dino nuggies. You get to choose your character, upgrade your stats, and choose your weapons. Then enjoy chaos as you try your best not to be deep steamed with butter, garlic, salt, maybe some shredded cheese. Oh, I mean, uh, yeah, I'm just gonna let the video play and, uh, well, that's great. Now I gotta run to the store. Oh my god, look at all these fucking aliens. When I started the game, I breezed through levels 1 through 5 with a swiftness. However, there was still a problem, though. I didn't know what the fuck was going on. I feel like this is going to hurt me. I mean, I got it, right? Oh my god. I am the world's most dangerous. Oh my fucking god. And before I knew it, round eight was over. Well, what was I going to buy? Well, the most American thing I could. And let me tell you this. It did not help what the fuck so ever. And just like that, the run was ruined. <laughs> <laughs> but just like being a kid, I thought I could solve my problems by becoming old. And just like being old, time flies and I was already on fucking round six. I am the greatest potato. I will not be bait. And just like that, we got through six, seven, eight, even nine. Yeah, yeah, easy motherfucking peas. But to come to find out, uh, round 10 was not so easy motherfucking peasy. No! Oh, come on! <laughs> now, to cure my depression, I thought the best thing to do at the time was to start another game. Yeah, yeah. Now, I got to blow through levels 2 through 9 like a kid blows out birthday candles. After not being able to get past 10, I felt demoralized, defeated. Over and over again, I just couldn't do it. But then I clapped everybody and gave my confidence back. Let's go! Now, after soaring through 10 and 11, I was fueled with confidence. I even made up a new rule set. The five B's of bo a potato, bodge, buck, bit, five and bodge. With this new set of rules, we got through the next three levels pretty easily. Let's go. However, it did not work for the fourth one. No, come on. <laughs> after another humiliating defeat, I turned back to what I thought I knew best. Yeah, yeah, pistol time, baby. And you know what I thought would go good with the pistol? Another gun. I thought this time it was gonna be so good. And tell it wasn't. <laughs> what? And after another humiliating loss, I thought to myself, how can I cure this depression? That's when I found the Uzz Man. The Uzz Man taught me two things. How to get through adversity and how to Uzz. I definitely want to uzz these ones. But we did fall short though, because uzzing is never uzzing enough.
be in a lot of uzzes and only fill in one more game. I ran the numbers, I did the research, and I figured out the best course of action. Fuck it, back to the basic. After making this hard choice, I just couldn't believe it. I was actually starting to do pretty good. Oh my god, no idea anymore. Let's go! After finally reaching the 15th floor, I thought I was gonna crack. After seeing what was on that level, I knew 16, 17, and 18 were gonna be just a breeze. After cruising through those three levels, my confidence was high. I didn't think anything could happen until the heartbreak came. No, there's fucking 10 seconds left, come on! <laughs> and after a full day of trying to be a king potato, I guess I only ended up like a smashed one. Leave a like, or I'll come us.